right, I'm gonna get straight to the point here. This video is gonna be showing you how to install mods for Left 4 Dead 1. First of all, what we're gonna need is a program called GCF Scape. We'll be downloading and installing that together right now. We'll do the installer. Okay, once that's done, you wanna go ahead and run that. This is the program you will be needing to extract the files that we will be needing later on. Okay. Right, so we're going to navigate to our games directory. You can access it through your library here. Right click it, properties, local files, browse local files. You want to go to this folder named Left for Dead, no spaces, no other garbage after it. And what you will see is all of these VPK files, pack files. These hold all of the game's files, you know, as far as textures, models go. What you want to do is, if, if it's not already set by default, open with uh, GCFscape. What we will be needing to do here is extract these. First of all, it's... Oh, for now, let, let's just put them on our desktop. Alright, so it just finished up here. What I'm going to go ahead and do is take these files, which should be materials, models, particles. I'm going to cut them and paste them in the Left 4 Dead folder, which had these pack files. Now, if it asks to overwrite anything you want to go ahead and press yes to that okay these are pasted in now so since the files we've extracted from these VBKs are already in the game folder what we're gonna go ahead and do is just delete all these pack files now to be on the safe side you might want to do the same thing with the DLC 3 folder ignore these these are ones I added in but the DLC 3 folder has VPKs too, and what you might want to do, just to be safe, if you have mods that might replace anything from there, extract, put it on the desktop. Once the DLC folder is done, you just want to do the exact same thing. Cut, paste, overwrite any files that might be overridden. Now that the files have been pasted into the folder, just delete the VPKs, same as last time. Of course. So, now that we have all the files extracted, I'm going to be showing you where to install the mods, which is in the add-ons folder. Here you will be dropping in your VPKs for your different mods. Anyways, I hope this worked for you. Thank you. Bye.